that time for Word. Man, I, I do so much of this stuff. Man, I, I be mixing myself up sometimes. Motivational Monday. Motivational Monday. Um, got a special guest, man, uh, for you guys today. A uh, really good friend of mine, um, Nashawn Garrett. Um, I'm not sure where he's at right now. I think he might be in Arizona, but man, he's always um, always doing man a, a bunch of cool stuff. He's a um, he's a wrestler, man, a state champion, man. I, I can't even get all the credentials right, you know what I'm saying? But man, I hope, like state champion, right? State champion. State champion. Uh, uh, you won, like, the whole collegiate championship, right? That's right. That's right. Collegiate, like, literally, what year did you win the collegiate, like, championship? 2016. 2016, man. You could, this man was on ESPN. Man, Espen, the magazine and everything, man. I was so proud of this guy, man. Hails all the way from Chico, a uh, place where I've been, called home for the past 15 years. Man, so proud of this guy, man, does so much, man, is uh, training for the Olympics and, man, doing a bunch of stuff, man, coaching, has camps, man, pretty much is a boss at, at everything he does, man, so inspiring, so motivating. Go ahead and follow this guy on Instagram, uh, Nashawn Garrett with an underscore. Um, I'll go ahead and post that on my story uh, so you guys can, can follow him, but, yeah, man. Did, did I miss anything? Did I miss any credentials? That, that, that's the best introduction I've had in, in years. All right, man. So it's Motivational Monday. Um, man, I, I love doing these. Every first Monday of the month, I'm going to have a special guest, Motivational Monday, Sean Gary. Obviously, you got to stay super motivated to do everything that you're doing, man. When, when it comes to training for the Olympics, man, winning, man, the, the collegiate championship and state championship, like all this stuff. So I just figured, man, you could share some uh, some tips and tricks on how you stay motivated, man, just throughout your journey. Got it. Yeah, of course, man. Jahai, thank you so much for, uh, for giving me this opportunity, bro. Uh, this, obviously, for those of you don't, who do or don't know, me and Jahai go way back. Uh, like 15 day. years, like Saturday morning cartoons, we go back. <laughs> we go way back, and uh, he's always been uh, he's always been a real, real amazing person and a real amazing brother to me. And um, so I just this is uh, I never take any opportunity for granted. I'm always it's it's this thankfulness is a, is a huge part um, about this lifestyle, and it's something that I just want to show gratitude and thankfulness to you for even allowing me to you know to be on here with you. No, I'm thankful that you're on, man, for real. I got the most joins in a, in a Motivational Monday ever. <laughs> <laughs> so uh, so motivation, right? Motivation. So uh, what Jahai is talking about is, is correct, right? So obviously right now, uh, so I'm a two-time state champion, four-time All-American national champion, and uh, a world team member in 2018. Before I tore my pe pectoralis major tendon, you guys can see this. I tore my my pec muscle here, and I got surgery on it. And uh, right, so I mean, one of the first places I'd like to start, right, is is one your why, uh, what motivates a person is is your why, right? Mm -hmm. it's why are you doing what you're doing, um, and are you yeah, what is it? What What's the reason why you're doing what you're doing? Because here's the deal, right? Um, if my reason for doing what I'm doing is, you know, trying to get money, trying to be famous, trying to do all these things, right? Something like this, like, uh, mm -hmm. you know, getting a surgery, something like that could take the person out, right? You have to ask yourself why you're doing what you're doing. And if you don't have a goal as to, like, why you're doing what you're doing, then it's going to – you're going to have, have a really, really hard time. So for that's me, good. One, one of my – biggest wise uh really stems from the the grace of the father right uh mm -hmm. i have to i i have to realize that i've been given a lot uh, in my life right whether it's the mental fortitude the physical strength the uh the speed the ability you have to look at the giftings and you have to look at the talents you have to look at the desires that you have and you have to say wait a second uh 
if I've been given these things, should I use them or should I not use them? Right? Mm -hmm. So you don't, you don't, you don't get a hundred bucks to invest in something and say, should I use this or should I not use it? Right? You got to right. say like, Hey, if I've been given something, I need to either use it or I'm going to lose it. Right? Oh yeah. It's oh yeah. Loser, use it principle. Mm -hmm. So that's the big motivation for my, my biggest motivation is if I've been given something, then I, I, I owe it to myself and I owe it to other people to, to use it to the, to the fullest and best of my ability. If that makes yeah. sense. That does. Motivation. So that, that's the why.